A tattered piece of crime scene tape on Garfield Street marks where 23-year-old Jeremy Snow was found dead inside a vehicle Thursday morning. No one living nearby wanted to talk about the violent crime consuming this community. It's become the norm that whatever happens, a gun ends up there. However, Lakeitha Hill, a member of Moms Demand Action, says violent crime is changing Clarksdale. Not only does it terrify people, but it makes people don't want to live here. It makes people don't want to come visit here. Moms Demand Action works to raise awareness about gun violence. And for Hill, it's a mission devoted to the memory of her 18-year-old son, Davion, a Clarksdale High School football player with a promising future. He had um, just signed a scholarship to play ball, and a week later, he was murdered. Hill believes in stronger gun laws, stiffer penalties for gun crimes, and wants the public to contact police when they witness crime. If we, as the people in this community, want a safer community, then we all got to come together and help the police when the police is helping us. I'm told more local, state, and federal undercover officers are on the streets, and it's hoped a unique intervention and mediation program between victims and defenders will also lower crime. Clarksdale's mayor says he's going a step farther. Over the last 90 days, there has been an uptick in gun violence throughout the entire Mid-South. So we're collaborating and working with mayors to find out why is this trend line occurring. In Clarksdale, Mike Suriani, WREG News Channel 3.